Could have two recovering defenders. Stop, stand still! Going back, let's go. Because I was saying it, as soon as the cross and the shot was going in, I was saying it, potentially we could have to coach two recovery runs here. Okay, so it might not be one, might not be two, it could be three. Again, it's a small side of game. Okay, so our two boys at the minute are out of the game. What are we going to try and ask our two remaining defenders to do? They've got to try and delay the attack as much as possible. To be fair to the two boys, they're still getting their breath back because they've done what? Yeah, they're doing what I've asked them to do. Okay, as soon as we've lost the ball, the both of them have recognised it and they're on their bikes to try and get back in as quickly as possible. Our saving grace in that is going to be what, by the way, from that attack? Okay, the execution wasn't great that time. That doesn't mean to say the next time this happens, that his throw won't be good. Okay, what were you looking for? The ball over the top, okay, so the ball over the top, if that's what he's looking for, and I'm not telling him, you're going to throw it into his feet or you're going to go wide because he's not on my team, I don't know what he's thinking, so I'm asking him, that's what he was looking for, what could be the simplest solution to the ball over the top in this scenario, no sorry for him, because he is going to play the ball over the top, so I'm looking to stop that. Well, you, yeah, you were up here. He was making the run back, guy. Right? Is there another player that can help us? Okay. Again, we've talked about the starting position. Again, realistically, the keeper down that end isn't going to threaten, so I'm just going to ask Luke to come up a little bit more. Okay. He's given instruction to his players, but that time when the ball was thrown, throw it out. It was a. Oh. We're going back on moves. Where's Alan Simpson? Okay. As the ball's come out, it's beaten the attacker. Defenders can just be a little bit savvy here because if it's going over his head, is there anyone else can affect the game for them? Yeah, it's just holding your ground. Kind of hold them in there. As that ball goes over the top, if our goalkeeper's in a good starting position, he can deal with it. Just give it back up to him. Now, if the attack had have developed in terms of the played in defeat, okay, so just roll it, give it into race feet. Now we really have to start thinking about delay. Okay? We really have to start thinking about it. Andy's starting to adjust already. Now you were tight to him. Mm -hmm. Okay? So if he gets the ball in there, we're just going to ask him, can he force him back? Okay? So again, we're down nice and low. Because we're talking about balance of defenders, not balance in defense, but our balance of defenders. If I'm too upright and Ray's nice and big and strong, he can bully me there. Whereas if I'm down nice and low, I can now start to apply a little bit of pressure there. Okay? So I'm just going to ask him to stand up. And he's dropped off. Again, just to give us a little bit of cover. There's not a lot of threat on that side. The cover is here in case 